in Northern Ireland. Theresa May is expected to promote her Brexit plan. Northern Ireland's border with the EU is one of the major concerns in Brexit negotiations. Well, for more, we're joined by Chris Curtis in London. He is an international politics expert for the polling firm YouGov. Thanks so much for joining us. I mean, help us understand what's actually on the table now as far as Northern Ireland is concerned. And is Theresa May actually preparing for the possibility of a hard border? Well, Theresa May has started um, moving what was previously her red lines in these negotiations with the EU. So in terms of the relationship that Britain has in the future, she laid out her negotiating lines, what she would not accept. And now slowly some of those are starting to disappear as she goes into those negotiations. As you mentioned, a lot of that is to do with Northern Ireland and to do with what happens on that border in Northern Ireland. Because the border needs to be kept open. The public in Northern Ireland, the public in Ireland and the public in Britain are all broadly supportive of keeping a, of, of stopping a border um, between on the island of Ireland. But at the same time, that does mean that she has to have a closer relationship with the EU than she would like and that like many of the British public would like. And we're also hearing more about the no deal option. How is that an option? Wouldn't it be disastrous for the UK? Well, that's, that's one argument that's often put forward. When we test this in public opinion, we run um, lots of polls and surveys here at YouGov, the British public broadly don't like a no deal. So if you put the option of staying in the European Union up against um, no deal, 55%, a majority of the public would vote for staying in the European Union, whereas just 45%, so 10% less, would support an, a no deal scenario. Okay, Chris Curtis, unfortunately, we're going to have to leave it there. Thanks so much for joining us from London. Well, seven years ago in Libya, militiamen...